Boston Red Sox add trio of World Series champions to 2024 Hall of Fame class. Welcome Red Sox fans, subscribe to the channel TO receive the latest Red Sox news. Help US reach the thousand subscribers so that our channel arrives for more people I count on all of you. The Red Sox Hall of Fame was instituted in 1995 and has recognized the team's most influential and successful players, managers, executives, and moments ever since. Nobody has been inducted since 2020, though, when David Ortiz and Manny Ramirez headlined a five-member class. For years later, a trio of World Series champions will be enshrined and honored in their own right. Eisen Power is an innovative dietary supplement designed to enhance male performance, virility, and vigor. Formulated with a blend of natural ingredients, it aims to support and improve men's sexual health and overall well-being. In an era of holistic wellness, Eisen Power strives to provide a solution that not only focuses on sexual performance but also addresses general health using ingredients that offer multiple benefits. This supplement emerges as a promising option for individuals seeking a natural means to boost their sexual confidence and nurture their body's health. Purchase Eyes and Power now with a $300 discount on the official website. I've left the pinned link below in the comments. Take advantage of the offer for a limited time. Dustin Pedroia, Jonathan Papelbon and Trot Nixon will be joining the Boston Red Sox Hall of Fame in 2024, cashing in on their lasting success with the historic club. The Boston Red Sox announced Monday that Dustin Pedroia, Jonathan Papelbon, and Trot Nixon will make up the club's 2024 Hall of Fame class. Pedroia spent the most time with the Red Sox of the three, debuting in 2006 and remaining with the team through 2019. In that time, Boston won three World Series titles. As an individual, Pedroia was one of the most prolific second basemen of his era. He won AL Rookie of the Year in 2007, then AL MVP in 2008, all while making four All-Star games, winning four gold gloves and earning one silver slugger. Pedroia finished his career with 1,805 hits, 140 home runs, 725 RBI, 138 stolen bases, and a 51.9 war. He drew 624 walks, compared to his 654 strikeouts, and his career batting average was .299. Papelbon made his MLB debut in 2005, and he was with the Red Sox until 2011. He made four consecutive All-Star appearances and served as Boston's closer during their 2007 World Series run. Before going on to make another two All-Star games with the Philadelphia Phillies, Papelbon went 23-19 with a 2.33 ERA, 1.018 whip, 10.7 strikeouts per 9 inning, 219 saves, and a 16.2 war in Boston. Nixon, unlike Pedroia or Papelbon, was hardly ever recognized as one of the best players at his position. The right fielder was never voted into an all-star game, and his only regular season honor was finishing ninth in the 1999 AL Rookie of the Year voting. Across his 10 years with the Red Sox, Nixon racked up 912 hits, 137 home runs, 555 RBI, and a 22.3 war while batting .278 with an .845 OPS. But Nixon really shined in the 2004 World Series, helping break Boston's infamous 86-year championship drought with his red-hot bat. He hit .357 with a .971 OPS while starting all four games against the St. Louis Cardinals that October. Red Sox fan, you like these choices for the Hall of Fame? Leave your like and your opinion in the comments and share and activate notifications and subscribe to the channel TO receive the latest Red Sox news. Help US reach the thousand subscribers so that our channel arrives for more people I count on all of you.